I've been doing genetic association studies since 2000, since the human genome was mapped, using Illumina arrays since they were first introduced. We do a lot of family-based association studies for asthma. And in these types of studies, you have to have complete genotyping on both parents and the affected proband. I've really been focused on asthma primarily. I became the director of personalized medicine at Partners, and the charge was to build a program in personalized medicine that would provide core services for investigators at the two academic medical centers, Mass General and the Brigham. My life is sort of two pieces. It's asthma genetics and genomics half of the time, and then supervising this partner's personalized medicine infrastructure the other half of my time. In the partner's biobank, we have 36,000 subjects in the biobank. We've genotyped the first 10,000, and we're giving that data away free to partner's investigators so that they can further their own research with this data. We've seen an unbelievable demand for that data. So we take the, the genotyping, impute it to whole genome, give it to investigators. What we find is, is that then people identify certain things that are relevant to their own research, either a rare variant or something else, and then they come back to the biobank for more samples to either do proteomics-based studies or gene expression or whatever. We've been using Illumina arrays since uh, I started doing genotyping, since the very first arrays were put out. The reason we use them is that they're very high quality, particularly useful for family-based studies where you've got to have complete data on all three subjects, and genotyping loss and incomplete data is just not an option. The completion rate with Illumina chips is on the order of 99%. The other aspects of this are really good support in terms of the bioinformatics, you know, getting reagents, support for setting up the genotyping equipment, and being able to provide good customer service all through that pipeline. I think that uh, the Illumina product is really uh, the most superior product on the market today. I've been very lucky in my career. Two areas that have had the biggest impact, I think, have been identifying vitamin D receptor as a gene for asthma and then going to test vitamin D intake in pregnant women and showing that it had about a 40% reduction in asthma in their offspring. You know, I'll be 70 in three months and I got so many different projects going, I'm not even thinking about stopping because I think we're so close to making some real advances.